So let's get our Sega CD on. Now that I've tested everything. That audio cord's a little weird. Let me hear some weird buzz. I guess not too much. It doesn't look like. It looks like it's something that's coming in on my end. Not on you guys' end. In a forgotten corner of the universe, a fierce battle was fought using mechanized technology so destructive it laid waste to an entire solar system. A lone mechanized warrior, its guidance systems damaged and pilot dead, shot away from the turbulent battle space. Destination unknown. It's been a while since I watched this. After untold ages, the Berserker entered the space of a planet abundant with unsuspecting life and ignorant of technology. Programmed only for death, the machine set about destroying everything in its path. It took the combined resources of the five mightiest wizards to divide and seal the power of the fearsome weapon. The damage inflicted on this small world was great, and many details of the assault were lost. However, even after a millennium had passed, people still spoke in awe as they recounted the legend of the armor and the five magicians of Vi. So let's play some of uh, Convey, or as it's called Vi. I always called it Vi. It's funny because it's called Vi in the first part. Dignitaries from all parts of the four kingdoms flocked to the royal event, for the young prince promised to be an important leader. I think I usually skip this. As the ceremony advanced, an insidious plot was unfolding. I do so promise. And do you? <laughs> oh, this. These working as I want. Classics. I was to say, oddly enough, I have to. The actual strategy guide from the 90s for this game. I think it came to the game when I bought it. I mean, I bought all these Sega CD games like 12 years ago. Something like that. Basically, uh, it was a long time ago. Oh, let me adjust the screen here. Yeah. So sorry, guys. It's just it's adjusted for the Super Nintendo, so now I gotta I gotta change it. What's up, Tribble? Find self-destructed ages ago. Yeah, uh, my model. Okay, so I've had a lot of Sega CDs. It's kind of a guilty pleasure of mine. So um, hold on, I gotta move this over to. With this side. Um, there we go. Let's do that. I might even go to the overworld first. So, I used to play Sega CD with my uncle all the time. God bless him. But, um, this game was one of the first RPGs I ever played. Sega CD, or I guess the first RPGs I ever played, generally. Prince, Prince, uh, sir, wake up. Oh, my head, what? Where am I? Oh, Saren, we're under attack. No, wait, it's it's quiet. Alin, where's Alin? They did my young prince. 
The brother managed to attend him first. The king and queen were seriously hurt. What? Father, mother. Oh no. Oh, your majesty. I'm so sorry. Uh, this is actually my JVC XI, which I got when I started buying all my Sega CD stuff. Because I, I swear that we rented one of these, or I saw one of these when I was a kid. Because I remember it being all in one, and thinking it was like the coolest fucking thing either. Coolest fucking thing ever. My god, mother, father. I'm glad I got it when I did, because it's like super pricey now. Highness, your mother, the queen is no more. Oh, how pitiful she looks. And father, oh father, there truly is no dignity in death. Sandor, you come. Son, come near to me while my soul yet remains. Father, you're still alive. Just lie still. I'll fetch the physicians. No, my vision grows dim even as we speak. Please listen carefully. Whenever trouble threatens Flora, the monarchy has always turned to the sage Otto the Wise for advice and guidance. Now more than ever, we need his insight, his knowledge. Seek out Otto. We will know the way. He will know the way to save the kingdom. Ugh. Father, no! Hold on. Goodbye, my son. Turn to your duty now. I, I know you will not be able to go. Father! Prince Sandor, I mourn. Who did this? The enemy? Who is the enemy? He used to have a nice selection of games for it, including the one. Medical Dorn. Michael Dorn was over. Oh shit! I think I know what you're talking about. You're talking about you're talking about Warf, right? Well, I I vaguely remember the game with Michael Dorn. It was that notorious filth from Danik, my liege. Who comes? A loyal soldier of the Garrison Majesty. Soldier, report on the disposition of the enemy. After they succeeded in abducting Elin, they made a retreat. But by then our battlements were de decimated. Sir, the carnage is beyond description. The Iron Giants were invincible. They are armed with cannons and strange weapons of fire. You filthy dogs, they shall pay dearly. How, my liege, are we to defend such against such a power? I'm sure Otto the Wise holds the answer, my friends. I'm sure. But where can he be found? Like most magicians, he prefers the quiet of the cave or keep. I've heard he's been s seen near Poth Cave. Off cave, yes. That's the old mine in the south, right? I shall leave at once. I'll track down the savages who stole them from me. Then I'll avenge the murder of my parents, or die trying. Yeah. What a badass. Otto, he can be found in a bus. <laughs> nice. Well, hey, bar dude. I can't. I can't talk like that. Woohoohoo. I tried. I tried my auto voice. Sorry. All this blood's cool. Now I'll play the um there's like a a D translation that somebody did for these working design games. I was having like a hell of a time burning the discs though. Um But now I just figured I'd play the original one for now. Um But yeah, no, I remember we rented this game and we played the shit out of it. Uh, let's see, can I go in here? I can go in here. Hold on. Oh shit, can I save it anywhere? Hold on. Just curious. Nice. That's awesome. I hope it's saving on the console though. I'll check it and make sure it saves on the console because the cartridge was uh, acting up a little bit. No, yeah, I have a weird affinity for Sega CD. Um, it was the first Sega console I ever played, so there's a lot of stuff on it like I'm pretty. Uh, nostalgic about. There was some pretty bitchin' RPGs, though. Okay, you know what? I should probably leave the castle. I don't think there's anything here. Hold on, let me check my items. No, I have a short sword. Okay. 
Yeah, I should probably leave. But... Wait, can I run? Yes, you can. Haha, uh -huh. okay. Loading time. Alright. Hold on. Let me adjust the screen now that it's on the overworld. I didn't want to do it when it was off the overworld. Because when there's there's like those black backgrounds everywhere. There we go, that's that's pretty decent. Oh, this game brings back memories. Alright, so let's try the town down here, I'm pretty sure. Ah, yeah, I can run. I'll finish this quest in half the time. Yeah, seriously, if you can run like that. Oh. Hey, what's up, Plexamos? I'm doing okay, just working and such. Hold on, guys. I'm stupid because. Hold on. For some reason it adjusted wrong. So you can tell it's on the console because it has all those weird fuzzy lines. There we go. Is that that's a little better, right? Thank you. Um, I kind of just I actually just put my hair back. But thank you. But that's why I did it is to get my hair out of my eyes. Oh wow. Okay. Well, this game has weird aspect ratios from battles to. Battles to non battles. I got I guess I'll just have to deal with that. <laughs> oh man. I appreciate it though. No, there's a there's a lot of grinding in this game, so ready for the grinding. Tomorrow I'll have orientation for grad school at 9 a.m. So it's lagging. Nice. Cthulhu saves the world. I know. I know. I need to play that fucking game. I have it on the 360. I actually have all three of them. I have the first two on the 360, and then I have the third one on Steam. Oh, well, congrats. You deserve it, Plexmos. Hey, mister, you know what? Want to know what? We saw... We saw some big boats. They was flying in the air. My daddy says they're going to the king's house. I'm making sure I'm pressing the right button for search. You buy the Christmas version of Cthulhu that came out a few months ago. No, I haven't. I haven't got that one. I just have the first three. I need. I need a play. Hey, what's up, Bo? That'd be a fun one to play on stream. I think. Yes, I know Otto. He stops here often for supplies. He's a strange one, though. He prefers his dank cave for the comforts of a modern town. And to be honest, I like them, but I was always, um, I was always waiting for, like, a special occasion to play them, so. Maybe I should stream them. Alright. Say it's not so. They tell me metal monsters have ripped apart the cave. Our king is dead. And what's more, the princess, princess bride was stolen, even as she spoke her battles. Okay, so, let's see. Castle Arath was attacked, but I wonder if Fort Gillian is okay. We've had no news from the quarter. The villagers of Smythe should know. I tell you, those giants drop from the, their skyboats like birds and spat fire. Balderdash. No one could put boats in the sky. Not even Odo. Alright. The running's nice, but it's not great in dungeons because you run into stuff. Game Studio also made a really good game called Cosmic Heroin. Huh. I'll check it out. Yeah, I first saw their stuff on the Xbox Live Arcade store back in the day. And I kind of just... I don't know. That was like one of my favorite times for indie games. Just drink some iced coffee if you guys want. Okay. Yes, Otto. As a sage, wise beyond our understanding. But he's also a good teacher. 
He's taken on the cutest little elf boy as an apprentice. I don't know where Otto lives exactly, but he comes from the south. It's like a female-based RPG with aliens and futuristic worlds. Oh, cool. I will have to check it out. Okay, leather boots. I have several games on my 360 hard drive. Hit the games. Yeah, me too. That's how I was actually. I was getting my 360 up and running because uh, I'm gonna start playing through some of those. Um, I don't know there was just such great stuff. Stream Cthulhu. That'd be a fun stream. Yeah, definitely. I think you guys would enjoy it too. Uh. Hmm. So I think I need to go with weapons first. Five eighty. Okay. Trust me, I need to. Okay. Twelve out of eighteen. Trust me, you do need to grind in this game. Man, I wish the aspect ratio didn't change constantly. That's kind of... That's kind of funny. I think there's a setting for that, but... It's okay, I don't mind. As long as you can see everything on the screen, that's what's important. I own the rare NCAA 14 for the 360, the last game I've made. Those for 150. Oh, wow. I should have bought it. I don't know why I didn't. Okay. Go to the inn. This town is called Jeffel. I like how it says the town's name up there. I always thought that was cool. Our king is gone, our queen is gone, the Danic scum is paperless. These soldiers have struggled in. They might tell you more. No, let me stay at the inn. Yeah, that was about the time I stopped playing. I think 2012 or 2013 is when I stopped playing Madden. Um, mostly I just got tired of, because uh, I played like somewhat competitively, and I just got tired of like people would like I don't know, they would cheat, or they would, like, they rage quit, and there was, like, I would never get points because they would rage quit, but I would always lose points because people would, um, of course, the best people that you play are going to beat you, but I would never quit, so. It's nothing more. It's nothing, your highness, merely a flesh room. Takes more and Danix ten monsters to do in all hubs. Yeah. It was a different time back then for sure. Hobbs was hurt bad. He'll make for the fortress as soon as we're able. Sire, we can only pray that Danic did not read to the where it was. I think the immortals here get with us. Okay. I just have to search I have to search everything because you never know. It's gonna be like the one thing I don't search is gonna have like a magic ring in it or something. I know how these games work. Alright. So I'm just gonna get that sword. And then uh, we'll trek down to the cave. I'd, I'd go to the cave anyways, but... Um, you might as well stay for the sword because if you try to go in the cave... Without training, you just like, you just get your ass handed to you. I just get a level. And none of this attempting to get all the money possible from a game. Yeah, I really hate that people do that. Sports games, a lot of them these days have microtransactions. The city only cares about money. Some sports games are like the same game each year. Yeah, and it's it's sad too because like if you knew like how big of a football fan I am, 
I would love like a good copy of Madden. Like nobody would want that more than me, but I just when they started doling out the same stuff and they start taking stuff away, I just couldn't support it anymore, and so I just stopped buying it. Yeah, it's fine though. It's a it's definitely a different genre, and honestly, like you were saying, like people just find older games. Like, I just get updated rosters for Madden on the PSP or uh, Techno Super Bowl. Man, I used to buy I used to buy the basketball game every couple of years. I would buy Madden and I would buy NCAA. I think I bought them like four or five years in a row. So, I mean, I was a pretty pretty avid fan, but I stopped buying like so many new games all the time. When I started collecting retro games, I just, uh, I hit a point where I was like, well, $60 for a new game, or I can get a retro game, because the new game is just going to go down in price. The retro game is going to go up in price or stay the same. So, see, we already have, we already almost have the Enough for the sword. No, this this game is pretty sick, though. This game had a had an Ares moment in it before I ever played Final Fantasy VII. So I remember 2K actually bought the rights. So it's definitely maybe they worked out a deal. Hey, college athletes more oh nice yeah if they're gonna pay athlete college athletes that's fine with me I know it doesn't seem like any of the sword but trust me I used to buy more often than not yeah you just hit a point where you I, I think every every gamer hits a point where they just like they find their niches like I don't know and then when you find your niche, you stop kind of buying as many, like, random things. Like, I think the best thing I ever, um, I ever started doing was, uh, just collecting, collecting the games I wanted to play on each console. Like, because I know so many people, you'd watch videos and people would be like, I gotta have a complete collection. My thing is, is like I just want a collection of the games I want to play. So many un unplayed good games on Steam, GOG, Bad Man, and Epic. Dude, Epic gives away so many free games. I feel like if you have a PC, you should have Epic no matter what, because they just give like every couple of weeks. It's like two more games. It's like the odds are there's going to be a game in like a couple months that you'd want to play. I think it was five, five eighty. I have too many games I haven't finished. Yeah, me too. That's what I'm trying to do. So when you guys see me streaming this stuff, like, like this game, I played this game so many times. You know, I played it back in the day as a kid. You know. I played it now, but I never beat it, so I was just like, ah, oh, I need to beat it. Somebody mentioned it on stream the other day, which was weird. Super weird, considering, like, the timing of everything. Because I've been thinking about this game a lot, and I was like, you know what? I should pop that in and play it. It's weird, some of the little graphical stuff. Because this is an actual copy of the game on the JVCXI. So it's weird some of those little spots that happen, but... I've played many games, almost beating it and stopped and moved on to another game. Yeah, that too. My plan is to go through all these old school like RPGs and stuff and random other games, you know. 
I don't know, I like to mix it up. Oh, that should be enough for that sword. And enough to heal at the end. Yeah, it was 580. Let's sell. No, let's equip and then sell. Short sword. Long sword. And how much is the armor? Hold on. Man, that one guy who streams Retro has played almost every SNES game. Huh. That's pretty cool. I have to I have to switch it up. Like, I love SNES, and I love PlayStation, and I love Genesis, and I love Dreamcast, so it's 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 gonna be a long time. Um Let's get the Quiltic tunic. Because I'm really close to it, it's going to be like... You know what? Is that the head? Okay, yeah, let's go close to the tunic. It's, it's going to take me like, what, like... Two battles to get it? You follow him, it's like I... Hold the on the stream. I think so. I think I know what you're talking about. Dude, I'm bad with names. I would know if I saw him. I'd be like, oh yeah, that guy. Oh, see, we already had enough. It was three battles, I think. Uh, body. Which you might if I could sell the winning clothes. How much are herbs? Let me see how much herbs are. Cause I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna buy a couple of herbs. I know, I play, I play too cautious. I just don't like dying over and over again. Oh my god, this guy doesn't sell herbs right now. Oh, it's the bar. Where's the item shop? Oh, this guy's the item shop, hold on. Hold on. Herbal extracts. Let's get two of those. So now we have four herbs. That should be enough. And then how much is the inn? 20 gold, I bet. Fuck. Fight, go to the inn, and then we'll head to. Bill and Ted 3 comes out in theaters and online through YouTube by this week. Oh, cool. That's awesome. I didn't know it was so soon. Dude, I was literally just watching the first one, like, before the trailer for the other one, before the trailer for the new one came out. The only thing that makes me sad about that is I wish George Crumlin was still around. We'll see if they, uh, we'll see if they Princess Leia at him, they Carrie Fisher, George Crumlin. Alright. They have to mention him at least. There we go. Hyper fighting. Alright. Rufus, yeah. Nice. Oosh. They they might have. Might have. Or maybe uh check this, like Rogue One status. Not just Leia, but remember they had that extra footage for the X-Wing fighters? He was like, Red 5, where are you going? He's like, ah, he's all crazy. Maybe it's something like that where there's extra footage of George Carl and his Rufus that we never saw. That they're just like, that they just like shot for some reason like a different, a different script or something. Oh, that was weird. Let me save it. Almost loaded. 
Ah, this music. This music is awesome. Wait, let me turn it up a bit. Just a little. Love this game. Alright. Yeah, battle-wise this game is kind of simple, but... There's a lot to like about this game. Check this guy out and go watch him just start to cast right now. Yeah. You know I'm always down to check other people out. Wheel view. Thank you, sir. He's dressed like a clown. Oh, I see. Oh, he does cosplay. So, so what if I did cosplay though? Like, what if I just started wearing my Indiana Jones hat every night, or if I just start streaming in my Kylo Ren mask? Wonder if you guys would uh, if you guys would be cool with that. If I got like a voice changer, where I was just like, just talk like right over and over time. We got four herbs, so we're fine. And I saved it, no worries. Darth Emo, get out of here. <laughs> but I found the exit stone. Now, I, I have a cool Kylo Ren helmet though. I have my Anakin Skywalker robes. Yeah, I think... I don't know. I don't know if I could do that. Too weird, I guess. Oh, and this is one of those games where you heal when you level up. There's two chests. I know I should be get I should be getting to the goal, but I want to get the chests. Man, I, I think I played this game before I owned a Super Nintendo. That's how long it got. Damn it! Not one of those. So well. I, I, I could probably use it on something else. I'm trying to press the trigger, like Dragon Quest on the Super Nintendo. I don't know. I like I like the new movies. I would take that with a grain of salt, my friend. All that stuff comes from like weird websites. I do know on the legit side though, I guess there's going to be a second, another series of Rebels, and then um, Timothy Zahn is coming out with those next Thrawn books, and there's rumors that there's going to be live action Thrawn. Everyone thinks it's going to be in the Mandalorian, I guess we'll see. 
But I'm more curious who is going to play Thrawn. Because I really wanted... I really wanted Agent Smith to play Thrawn. And or Elrond. I found a guy that at like 3 a.m. I was watching it. Oh man. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's just how those... But you know how all that, all that stuff is. Like, they, they say some weird rumors, man. That's why it's hard for me, because, like, I love, I love, like, trying to find that stuff, but then I have to... Oh, shit, you know what? This, that is where I came from, and then I'm gonna go up. You just never know, like, some of that stuff is just, like, like, super weird. You start watching Unsolved Mysteries. I've been watching it every night. Dude, I love Unsolved Mysteries. I love the original one. I love that stuff. I love crime stuff. The problem with that is, when I watch that stuff, I start having, like, because my imagination is so overactive, I'll have, like, nightmares about, like, like murders and stuff and like weird shit and then I won't be able to sleep for like a week and that's no one's fault that's just the way my mind works that's why sometimes I have to play stuff like this because then I'll have weird dreams about fighting grasshopper guys with scythes you know watch it and feel creeped out someone is inside outside yeah dude no that's what I mean that's that's exactly what I mean like there'll be one about a ghost story I'm like I know my house isn't haunted that's exactly why I live here because I've, I've been in haunted places you know my friend's house super fucking haunted like but I know this place isn't haunted but I'll be just sitting there and my mind will just conjure up things and that's how I know, like, you can, like, what, uh, what is that called? Um, shit. I'm trying to think of what that's called. But basically, when your mind, you imagine something happening, you think, it's like kind of like a placebo effect, but, like, you're imagining it so much that you start hearing noises and stuff. If I watch something, I'll invade my dreams as well. Yeah, and I love that kind of stuff. That guy, Robert Stack, the music they did the show is creepy and strange. Yeah, dude, the 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 OG Unsolved Mysteries, that shit, that shit's legit scared. You play mind tricks on yourself. Yeah, exactly. I think a lot of stuff is like that. Like, I think there's a lot of stuff that, like, you know what I mean? Like, if you think, if you think the night before, like, oh man, I'm going to have a terrible day. I'm going to have a terrible day. I'm going to wake up. Everything's going to be terrible. You're going to have a terrible day. You're going to, like, force yourself mentally, like, to conjure shit up, like, in the same way, positively. Let's watch our little Sega CD cutscene. Cut Quick Master, someone's come in. Hello, we haven't had a visitor here. Well, never. Did you get any monster bites? I can fix them. Is Otto? Hey there, Otto. Back to your work, you. You've got better things to do than stand around yanking all day. Oh no, teacher, I'm not yanking. Are you Otto, the legendary sage? Don't know how legendary I am. But yes, Otto's my name. What brings you to my damp abode? It actually costs $2,000 to own the whole series on DVD. Damn. That's funny. Hey, thanks for the look, Lurk Puller. Um, it is on, it, not all the seasons, but it's on Amazon right now for the OG version. It's kind of a long story, but here goes. I gotta repeat the dialogue, I think. Well, I see you have quite a job on your hands. Ah, uh, yes, Sandor. I knew when you were but a tyke. 
Alas, you probably don't remember. That was a long time ago, I don't remember. Uh, but enough about past time. Can you tell me how to defeat the Danik? Well, <laughs> uh, you don't want it much. They have already utterly crushed two nations. No sword, bow, or magic can match their new weaponry. But there is one way to end their insane watermark. Legendary armor. What? Seriously? I thought that was just a myth. It is as real as the edge of your sword and far deadlier. It once destroyed a world before they could stop it. And when it was finally stopped, they hid it and sealed its power. Yes, the story of the five magicians, but where is it now? Thunder... Thunderation, not so fast. And Sandor. Thunderation. To unlock the armor, you must unlock the source of its power, the orbs. Find them first, and you'll have the key that will bring the armor to life again. I suspect that one of the orbs is on the island of Magma off the west coast. I see. I'll give that a try. Thank you. Wait. It'll be dangerous to attempt this alone. It's dangerous to go alone. On Tubi, it's free. It's a free site to watch movies. One minute and it's up to 25 seconds. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Uh, I mainly watch stuff on my PlayStation. I'm lazy. Bottle. What is it, Master? I'm not in your way. So we used to, I used to name Link Pottle and Link to the Past because he had I was like, he's an elf kid. Like, that's how long ago I played this game. <laughs> uh Don't Sulk. I want to, to please I want you to please accompany the prince as a, his attendant. Really? Oh master. This lad is a disciple of mine, but he's still a bit inexperienced. He could use a little magic though. Take him with you. Yay, I'm going on real adventure. Thank you, Master. Stop fishing, and don't be a pest, Prince Sandor. I won't, Master. I can't help being excited, though. I'll protect Prince Sandor with the awesome magic you taught me. And then you get a cutscene showing the same thing. Woo! You could sure use a bath. Hmm? The pothole! Uh, oh, nice elf. Sorry, Master Otto. I didn't mean to offend the Prince of Laura. It oh. just kind of slipped out. Sire, with my magic I'll have to check it out. fighting skill, we'll make a great team. Trust me. Say, Master Otto, I'll be back before you know it. I will have to check it out. Oh. Now I can save it. Please, game. Okay. Puddle join the quest. Sorry, I thought I was going to freeze there for a second. Let me save it, speaking of. Ever watch the Zelda Sega CD cutscenes? Cut uh, you're talking about the... Ah, what is it called? The Philips CDI? And... Yes. Sadly. No, no, you're fine. Those are really bad. Several Transformers series is what got my attention. You know what? I've been wanting to rewatch the original one. Um, this might this might see me make me seem like a little less old, or I guess really old, because I used to watch the original one when I was like really really little, like two years old I think, two or three years old, and then um. I remember when I was in middle school, I think Beast Wars came out, and uh, we used to watch Beast Wars like all the time. Go sign up for Tubi and watch the 80s. Don't lie. Huh. Interesting. Fascinating. Oh yeah, he has that dagger. I forgot about that. <laughs> nice. I know. Freaking Beast Wars. Jesus. Well, 
Well, I mean, I used to I used to watch Reboot on um I think it was ABC when it first came out before it was on Toonami. And then when I was a kid, I was like, "Oh shit, I used to watch that when I was a little kid." And then it was on and then it was on Cartoon Network. And it like blew my mind. Cuz I was like, they're continuing it. PS4 Beast Wars or PS1 Beast Wars game. Dude, I always wanted that game, and then when I played it later, I was like, uh... I wish I would've had that back in the day. Oh, nice. Well, that's pretty awesome. Uh, let's go to... I'm gonna go back to this town just to go to the end. Even though I could probably press ahead. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Let's save it first. And then we'll equip bottle with the bolts of tunic. Seeing if I had any other items. I guess not. They make free stuff when they get money from thousands of people washing hands. Yeah. That's how they do it. I wish I was smart like them. <laughs> Alright. Now here's the thing. I don't remember if I'm supposed to go back to the castle, so I'm gonna go back and talk to the counselor guy, person, and then we'll go from there. Puddle needs the experience anyways. You ever wonder if you get more people in here if you stream retro? Uh, I think I am on retro right now, right? I should be. Let me double check. What the fuck, man? Uh, my OBS isn't um, updating. Well, thanks for letting me know. That's bullshit. No, OBS keeps doing that. Yesterday the chat wasn't updating. And I'm just going to start updating it on o on the actual website. This OBS Streamlabs bullshit just doesn't... It just does whatever it wants. Sorry about that, guys. It's okay. It it happens. I'm just just thank thank you guys for letting me know. I'm just gonna have to manually manually do it like back in the day. It's just OBS was like, hey, it's easier to add it on here. It's not easier at all. Bullshit. And to and to make it worse. It's it was it was stuck under the title of one of the uh, like three streams ago, so it hasn't changed in like like all last night when I was playing Evo, it didn't change. I'm so sorry about that, guys. Well, I guess I have a loyal fan base since I still had viewers and I wasn't even on retro, Jesus. Yeah, seriously. Oh, you know what? This is the new... This is the new town, I think. So let's see what they say here. 
The Danic army suddenly attacked us from nowhere. It was total chaos. We barely escaped. We've heard that Gillian has been taken by the Danic. If true, this information must be brought to the king at once. Jail a night. Because you have five viewers in here. Just figured you could expose. Yeah, yeah, no. Definitely. Yeah, no, I was supposed to be on Retro. This used to be a booming mining town. It is until the war petered out. Yep, this town has seen better days. Okay, there's something with the graveyard, but I don't need I don't know if I need to go there yet. I've got to get out of this village. The smith's hammering is driving me crazy. Let me see how much the new sword is gonna cost. Because that's gonna determine how long this is going to take? The items that make are sold at the weapon shop. I'll have dross. I have dross to skin. Excuse me. Get that fire for you, buddy. And. Uh, long sword, so I need a thousand. Uh, graves. Do they have amusing epitaphs? Um, there's like a hidden cave that leads somewhere. I love watching your streams at 3 a.m. Eastern drunk on coffee. Hell yeah. <clears throat> I was just drinking some iced coffee, now I'm drinking some cold Mountain Dew. Hold on. 600. Shit, I need a bunch of money. Oh, I have enough for the long sword. Okay. That'll help. Two hundred ninety, and yeah, I think you do have limited inventory here. You expose me to retro games. Also, I watch your YouTube channel, so I don't think nobody watches it because I watch every video. Haha, <laughs> nice. Thank you, sir. Definitely appreciate it. Don't worry, there's more stuff I'm working on. Um, I got Vegas Pro, so there's like some some anime reviews I'm gonna do, and also um, game wise. Maybe a little bit further down the line, because I'm kind of going for the stuff that I have, like, embedded in my head that I had already planned on writing, like, a while ago, so. Um, let's see how strong these guys are. Oh, you know what? Do I have to go... Hold on. I think I have to go north first. I think I'm trying to do this too early. Let's see your music get uploaded one day. Oh yeah, totally. That that is good. That's that takes a while. I I could upload my old stuff, but it's like for like some some stuffs from like two thousand seven, two thousand eight. So it's pretty it's pretty old. Uh, yeah, let's go north first, and then. Like, you can't come here. Can't remember what they say. Oh, circle it, nice. Whip. Definitely appreciate all the support for sure. You can hear voices behind the fortress door. It was over so fast, nothing can beat our new ant. I want to say ATACs. Yeah, fucking ATACs. No doubt about it. The unit who raided Loreth Castle 
got the woman, no sweat. Woman, they must speak of the way. Commander has some fantastic plan underway, but he's a genius. Why use ATACs to capture one girl? I don't second guess, Commander Sandal. I bet the Emperor is going to be mad at him for this, though. Commander, where is he? Maybe it was his idea. Say, did you happen to... Happen? What did happen to the girl they captured? I heard they made for the outpost down in... Herzolz. Owlin was strong. This fortress is crawling with Ganon Fortress. A frontal attack would be foolish. I must find some other way. I know, there's a secret tunnel we can use in Smith Village. A tunnel? How do you know? I studied with the masters. I know many things. Okay, okay. I read it in one of Otto's books. So sue me. Ha ha ha. A little bit of Star Wars. Alright. Hold on. 690. I love how fast this game saves. It's pretty much like save states before save states. The situation is black indeed. I need to get to Corian, but the fortress Fortress Gillian is occupied. Fortress Gillian was taken by surprise. We could be attacked at any time ourselves. My my, giant metalmen, flying boats, strange worlds. Now have another drink. I escaped just as Gillian was attacked. When I turned back to look, I saw it. Out from the belly of a red metal bird fell a huge iron man in a spouting flame. They dropped into Gillian like vultures. The soldiers didn't stand a chance. I heard a roaring sound like thunder. I was so scared I ran like hell. Yeah, most people would. Okay, so I have 670. Oh, let me sell this. That literally happened while I was walking into town. That's interesting to know. Okay. Yay! I get a awesome gin that's sticking its tongue out at me. A raccoon attack and a heart. I also heart raccoons with jewels. Leather boots. And you know what? I can get each of us leather boots. Oh my god, I hope I don't have leather boots. Seventeen, nineteen. 22. Shit. Okay, I didn't waste that much, because Pottle could still use them. I wasted 150, that's not bad. You should look into figuring out where you're stuck in Might Magic and go back. I love you playing that. Yeah, well, um. It was being stuck, but it was also because when I moved to the new computer, um, I originally I was using I was using this hack to make it HD, and then I had also like edited it, so I need to go back and do that, and I'm just lazy. Um, I will though. I was actually thinking about that the other day. God, where is it? Yeah, all the sound bites still work. I need to add more of them, though. Oh, you know what? Does someone talk about it? I know it's here. Secret passage. Hmm. Arrow the Smith used to work in the mine. Oh, okay. It's a it's a lock. Or it's a switch. They say you know a secret way into the fortress from this village. 
Oh, there's nothing secret about it. Just an old tunnel. It's been sealed for so long. Nobody remembers it no more. It starts off in the graveyard somewhere and ends up under the fortress hall. And that's where I'm going to train for a little bit. If you made some of your sound bites that were cooler, but it's not gonna lie, I'd pay you some. Uh, well, which ones do you think? Because there's a lot. I don't know. I've thought about different ones. Um, like, I don't really want to use curse words too much because I know. If I do that, I have a weird feeling. But you know what? Arrow was right. I have a weird feeling that if I did those, like they would just get spam. <laughs> but I mean, I don't know. I'm trying to think of. I guess I should just I should just think of better ones. Silver knife. Okay. So I think the silver knife only attacks one person though. Let's see. Yeah. Well, I think I had, I need to add some more practical ones, right? So, like, I have like, I have like victory, and I have some other ones, more cooler ones. What do you mean by cooler ones, though? Do you mean like? You mean like weird meme -y ones? Like where that guy's like, you wouldn't know a vampire if he walked up but bit you on the goddamn dick. Or like uh, Indiana Jones quotes. Like should I have one that's just indie? Like explanation mark indie. It just plays random Indiana Jones quotes. That's what I mean, I'm just not sure. <laughs> Oh, like add more of them. I got it. I got it. Alright, well, the next night off I take, I'll spend... I'll spend a couple hours doing that. I think I added a couple new ones. Hold on, let me let me see. There's, there's some... There's some I have that aren't on the, uh... Hold on. That aren't on the, uh... The thing. Uh, let's see. Hold on, I know there's one for sure. Um, I guess I don't remember which ones I have on the list and which ones I don't, though. Son of Skywalker must not become a Jedi. Alright, that was a little too loud. I'm sorry about that. Yeah, I need more Lord of the Rings. Shit. Okay, so he gets about two heals out for his magic points. I was trying to think if there's any more new ones. Yeah, yeah, uh, so... It wasn't that loud. Okay, cool. I'm just glad, uh, it's like soup. On mine, it's like, ah, uh, it's like a, like the gong show. Just like crazy loud. Um, God, there's a reference for you. Uh, <laughs> that I've only ever heard about. Um. Oh, these guys are kind of evil looking. Um, yeah, no, uh, it's just clipping them more than anything. I found a, I found it took me a while to find a program that I could clip because I have so, I have a lot of I have a lot of material. We'll just say that of uh, things that can get clips from well you, YouTube even, and um, it's just going through. I just don't want to add like stupid stuff. The, s the sound bites are perfect on your end. Oh, that's good. Um. 
Is it secret? Is it safe? I'm trying to find, uh, I was trying to find ones I added that I'm not, I wasn't sure if they're on the thing or not. That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over. That one's a pretty good one. Yeah, I need, I need like, uh, I need more like generic. Like clapping or cheering or like booing. I need stuff like that. If flesh and blood were as strong as pride, we would all be invincible. Oh. Run away. Oh, thank God. No, I was trying to find. There was ones I added that I, I was trying to find on the list there. I freaking lucked out. You got some cheesy horror ones. More 80s throwback. Yeah. It's just going through so like I'll like think of something like a show or a movie and then it's going through sitting there and being like okay would that line be good or that line? Uh, let's see. Oh god, those guys are pretty strong. That guy used to creep the shit out of me, by the way. Now he's dead. Damn it. This is it. I'm like getting my ass handed to me. You solve the mystery. The solve the mystery was the narrative on solve mysteries. <laughs> yeah, they are pretty serious. That's why I hate I hate to grind in this game, but it's like you have to. Like, all right, well, let's see. We have a thousand. Let's see if we can get another piece of piece of armor. I'm pretty sure we can. And also, I keep going to the goddamn goddamn pub. Oh, you know what? There's only a weapon store here. Well, let's go to the weapon store then. Oh my god, it's inside the weapon store. Okay. Defense plus eight. Okay, hold on. No, oh, sell. No, I don't want to sell that dagger yet. There we go. 
Mm -hmm. Castlevania on PS1 is such a great, creepy game to play by yourself. Oh yeah, Symphony of the Night. I need to play that again. I played that last year. The characters want beer. I know they keep they keep just like inadvertently. They're like, we need to go to the pub. Oh guys, I found the craziest freaking show from the early '80s. It's called Wizards and Warriors. And it has Zach from Babylon Five in it, and it's like super goofy and crazy. And actually, there's a there's an image from that show that I might have as one of my gifts, like one of my bit gifts, if it ever changes to random ones. Oh man, that show is fantastic, though. And it has the original Im Emperor from Empire Strikes Back, too, as like one of the bad guys. Oof. I gotta kill these white zombies. Just hope, let's just hope they don't turn into Rob zombies. <laughs> Alright, I'm sorry. I shouldn't make white zombie jokes. Goosebumps is getting brand new throwback. Uh, I probably won't check that out, but... I don't know, Goosebumps was kinda goofy. I, re I remember... I remember the craze, I really do. It was like right after the Power Rangers craze. It was like one of the first book crazes, because it was like that, and then immediately after, in sixth grade, that's when those Harry Potter books came out and people started reading those. I was never cool enough to get into Harry Potter. Uh, I wasn't alive really old than me. Apparently. I'm only 33. Alright. Alright guys, fuck it. We're gonna try to make it across. I should have bought way more herbs. You're at 495. I was holding back some white zombie reference. Isn't it Black Rain? Oh, uh, god damn it. I'm trying to think of the names of the songs now. It's been so fucking long since I've listened to White Zombie. Black Sunshine. It's Black Sunshine and, um. Shit, what's another name? I'm trying to think of another song now. Yeah, that, bring, that, bring, that brings back memories for sure. Oh, I was thinking about doing a video when I unbox those um, those Final Fantasy VII figures, just because I love them so much. And I'm gonna try to get if Series Two comes out of those, I'm gonna try to get all the series of those. I think there's a minute cooldown for the uh, for the so the sounds. I thought I, I thought I turned it down, but to like a couple seconds. But that thing's so fidgety. Well, like I said, it won't even update. It won't even update the fact that uh, that I'm playing a different different game. So but you know what? Don't worry, he'll get more magic. I still have I still have three herbs too. But 
go on Masquerade to video chat a girl. Talk Dragon Ball. <laughs> That's funny. Are you talking about like a Grandpa Gohan mask with the whiskers? Because if so, that's fucking badass. And also, I want one of those. Oh man. That is- that's fucking badass, dude. Uh oh, maybe this wasn't such a good idea after all. Who have we here? Oh, a pretty mess here in Puddle. Monsters, even. Fresh recruits, perhaps, or just common thieves. I am Sandor, Prince of Lorath. You're kidding. He's kidding, isn't he? What have you done with my bride? Who are you? You address Sandor, commander of the armies of Danik. Then you are the snake who murdered my my parents. Oh dear, I upset you. Uh, prepare to die, Danik Trash. I'm sorry, but I can't stay. I have a hectic schedule. But you're more than welcome to play with my pet here. I must be off now. Taha. Coward, you can't run forever. Uh, Sandor, I sure hope you have a plan. Alright, plan is heal. Also, that's the monster that was on the other screen. Also, this song kicks ass. Um, I just started this game. Sorry. Song kicks ass so much ass. Oh, damn. Okay. Oh, I have four herbs. Cool. Oh my. Oh, is eight? What's the... That's the hardest game I've played. Um, I don't know, that's hard to say. Probably Ninja Gaiden 3 on the NES or... Off the top of my head, it's hard to... It's hard to think about. Oh man, this is rough. Do I have magic? I do. Fuck. I bet I was pretty close. I bet I was pretty close to beating him. Hold on. I'll just reload the game. Let me check, yeah. Might have lost some experience. Actually, let's see. Yeah, we lost a little bit of experience. Sorry, guys. I know, I know. Let's get some... Let's just get some more levels. Oh, man, this is before we grind it at all. It's not too bad, though. We didn't do we didn't do that much grinding. We didn't do like a couple hours of grinding. Um I never beat the original uh, Earthbound. You're talking about Mother on the NES. The Super Nintendo one I never owned and I never played. Like I played it a little bit, but I never um I don't know, I like I like Mother on the NES and I like Earthbound 3. For some reason the Super Nintendo one just comes off as kind of weird. I should play it eventually. Um, by the time I had that thought though, where I was like, maybe I should play it, it was already like $175 and I was... I don't know. It's gonna be a while. Oh yeah, 
Uh, I beat Chrono Trigger a couple times. I beat Chrono Cross. Oh man. I should definitely play either of those on stream. playing Breath of the Wild on the Wii U. I actually played it on stream a little while ago. I'm so sorry, guys. We just... I, I, I need to not get my ass kicked. Uh, and honestly... Honestly, I need to buy... Way more herbs is what I need. Okay. It's not the Wii U. Breath of the Wild's really good. Oh, you want the you want the the goosebumps dummy laugh? See, I was gonna do the the emperor laugh. I just haven't got around to it. Where he's like, <laughs> "That's all good. Get some sleep, trouble. Thanks for hanging out. You have a good one." I wonder which level I should train to. That's impossible. Uh, I'm trying to remember in where never ending a story. Is it? Is it? It's Sebastian's talking to the princess. I think he's like, "That's impossible." I, I think that's what you're talking. About. It's been a while, dude. Um, yeah, let's get some. Let's get that sweet armor. That movie gives you nightmares. Giant electronic dog size house. <laughs> Oh, Falcor? Yeah! I just remember him sharing my song with Dragon. Like... Okay, I probably shouldn't like Never Ending Story, the first one, as much as I do. Or the giant breasted harpy statues. Where as a kid I was like, whoa, can that be in a movie? It's like a kid's movie, I'm like, what? In real life, it was a giant dog sized house. It wasn't CGI. Yeah, it's Clifford, they just painted him white instead of red.
I almost should have killed the model. Do you ever wonder if 80s movies creators run acid? Um, you know, I used to, I, uh, I was actually talking about that the other night, like, 80s movies are very, like, awesome, and they're very unique. Um, oh, whoa, that was crazy. But at the same time, I feel like, uh, I feel like 70s movies were just as crazy when you dig, you dig as deep into them. And, like, I don't know. It's just, it's just weird. Um, it's one of those things where I think if you study like a certain period in time, you find all kinds of weird little interesting things. Leather shield and then circlet. So we both have circlets, I think. Definitely use two leather shields. And how much would that be? 200? Okay, I almost have enough for that. And then. Ooh, 640. So 840. Alright, let's save it. And then, so I get 840. Let's get like 1200, so that way we can buy some, uh, some herbs too. Oh yeah, gremlins. Good old gremlins. That one's a pretty good one. Yeah, gizmo. Been a while since I've seen that one. Also, shit, I forgot to heal. So I'm gonna go back and heal before we do that. Furby's reminding me of Gremlins. Yeah, that's kinda. They're pretty similar. Uh, I forgot to go to the end. Oh, you know what? I have enough for those shields now. So now I only need 600 something. Never make the Furbies talk to one another. You know, I think my sister at one time ended up getting two Furbies to do that. And I don't ever remember if we ever could get them. They were supposed to do certain little other things, like if... <laughs> okay, the fucking stupidest thing is I remember we used to wake the Furby up, my sister would get so mad. By holding it upside down it would start crying, it would be like, Oh, me sad! Oh man, I fucking forgot about that. I actually took the batteries out of mine so I could bathe them as a kid. You could have died. Jesus. Well, you took the batteries out at least. You probably would have been okay. The Furby probably wouldn't have been okay though. Did you know that they wouldn't let you have Furbies inside the hospital at the time? Because there's something inside of them that'll like that'll like fuck with pacemakers <laughs> like no joke I can't, I can't even remember it's it's something in there it's like a signal but I think it's the signal that the Furby send each other to talk to each other
Oh, it was me, sad. Wow. Oh man. Oh, dude, you, I could get, I could get like a Furby. A Furby soundbite, where he just says random stuff. Whoa! Kind of reminded me of like a little Ewok, to be honest. Put a spy cam and a Furby and then put it in someone's yard. Oh man. It's kind of funny. Don't worry, guys, we're pretty close here. I should be able to beat that boss. I mean, two of those guys are giving me almost a hundred. Come on. Alright. What is this? Check this out. Oh no. Dude, I actually just found out about that the other day when somebody was talking about one of the rarest VHS tapes in existence. Was there, were those McDonald's? I guess there was one that wasn't released. Um, which is crazy, because honestly, dude, I never even knew about those. But it was, it was, it was crazy looking. I think they were drawn, they looked like they were drawn by somebody from Nickelodeon. I'll tell I'll totally I'll totally totally watch that though. Though I did I, okay, I went to McDonald's a lot when I was like Oh man, like 1990, 1991. When they had those little um fry toys. They have full moon movies and there's like six of them. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I think I'm... I think I'm good on that. On the Ronald McDonald. Alright. We're almost there. Let me just fight this battle. Get the next weapon. And then we'll f we'll go fight the boss. I'm gonna see how much I could sell that silver dagger for, though. Um, blue blow gun. Okay. Twenty. Oh, it's more powerful. Okay. So I have 144. Let's see how much I can sell. Oh, nice. 500? Okay. Let's go to the inn and then we're gonna. We'll go buy herbs and then we're gonna go destroy that guy real quick. And if not, I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely save it before then. Come on, where's the item shop guy? Is he not here? Oh, no, no, no. That's the other tail. Okay. Manticore. 
Oh, look at all those herbs. Seven herbs and spices. Watch the first three minutes of this live action. Okay. I'll check it out right after the stream. Right now I gotta kick some... Kick some ass. Oh, nice. There we go. Oh, it only attacks once. I thought the blow got attacked uh, several times. Oh, he double hit. Okay, I see. Well, it gets the boss, that that's probably going to be better. I should probably be like level 8. So, I'm trying to think of the furthest I've gotten. Okay, well, I mean, I got really far when I was a kid, but uh, recently the furthest I've gotten that I can remember is getting all four characters. And then... I think I was. I think I had a boat. I think. I'm trying to remember. I think this strange brew heals magic. Got this this time. Okay, it's ready. Just making sure the charge cord wasn't getting too, uh, smelled something weird. Oh, you know what? It's probably these Christmas lights. My Anakin Skywalker glove. See, I could cosplay too. Guys, let's do this. Yeah, man, watch this full six minutes of the video and let me know on Twitter. Alright. Let's see. Oh! That's 120 right there. Just with the magic. Alright, now I'm just gonna heal with the... Check this out. God, this music's so badass. Oh, 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 yeah. Very, very 80s.
Yeah, I have herbs now. What's up with it? My, uh, my herb strategy on RPGs, it totally is not fair at all. I think this started from uh, Breath Plague Breath of Fire 1. Come on, I gotta get a critical in there. Try. Oh, I don't know if I have enough herbs now. Shit. I mean, at least I saved it. Come on. Strange Brew just ups your... That just ups your health? Okay, I don't care, I won the battle. So that's what's up. Do you see any more of them? No, it looks like they all ran for it. I guess, or else they got what they came for and left. Are you saying they attacked the kingdom just to kid kidnap a lady? But why? The fortress of Ilan has been liberated. Liberation! Oh, I should get the ogre battle. Um, little sound effects. Friend Sandor drove away the marauders, all hail the prince. Your brave deeds prove the purity of your lineage, great Sandor, whereas we are not worthy to be called your subjects. No, don't say that. I did not fight the Iron Giant like you. Yes, but you defeated your opponent soundly. I wish I could say the same. Will you ascend the throne to take your father's place? Not until I avenge my parents' murder and rescue my bride. As things are, we are no match for the Danix weapons. We are on the defensive. In order to strike back, we will need the legendary armor of Bay. But sire, the evil armor of legend doesn't exist? And was it not sealed forever by the five magicians of Ring? It does exist, and it was sealed. But we must find it and unseal it soon. Out of the way, since it's our only chance to defeat the Danic. I see that I and a detachment of men will accompany you. No, the job requires speed and stealth. You must stay here. As Prince of the Realm, I charge you with the defense of the land of Bora. You'll defeat it. You'll defend it to the last man. Godspeed, sir. Oh, cool. Okay, hold on. Save. Alright. We did it, guys. Did it. Let's, uh, get these chests. Gnome Sand. I'm gonna take this glove off. I'm so sorry about that. It's such a goofy idea. But you know what? Hey, it worked. I beat the boss. Darth Vader's glove. Which was a weird Star Wars book when I was a kid. That has like weird shit in it. That's like totally not. Not like Star Wars y. Okay. So now I have to go to the next town, right? All this war and confusion has put a serious crimp in a bingo skip. My, my bridge game could be postponed entirely. 
I heard that you can get to Magma Isle by boat, if you can find one. Oh, I must have got past the boat then. School is closed when the Danik were here. Thanks to you, I have to go back. Short bow. All right. Oh. We have breastplates. Bronze shield, filtration mask, nail Let's get the breastplate first. Bronze shield. And then the sixteen. It's a lot. Hey, wow, there's nothing in here. That's weird. Alright. Feels like there's a dev room in here or something. I don't know where the next town is. Alright. We'll get to the next town before, before we end it here. I got pretty far tonight. Let's see if there's a town over here. There should be a town over here. Okay, there is a town here. Cool. Let's go see what they want. Hmm. 
Hey, listen. You gotta listen. Danic troops took all our ships away. What the heck are we gonna do now? Give me a ship. Well, we finally got here from the village, but the market's closed. The Danic took everything with them and their ships. Hey, have you ever been to see the Wind Fairy? She's magic and she's pretty. I won't believe what people say about her. I've seen the Danic weapons. They make me think of the stories my grandpa told me. Like ancient fairy tales. Wanna hear some? Long ago, before there were monsters, men built towers of glass and metal. Every town had many schools and the strongest magic was science. People zoomed around in armored wagons or flying ships faster than a sparrow hawk. Everyone had a magic window that let them see across the whole world. We never believed Grandpa's tales, but these new Danic machines, well, it makes me wonder. Yes, you can get to Magma Island from Koran, I'll tell you, you know. Start swimming, leave your stuff, and you'll sink like rocks. And, uh, don't mind the sharks, they haven't eaten anyone in around three hours. We know that the island is inhabited by a fierce monster. It's said to guard a terrible treasure. No one has ever looked for it has returned. I've come to take on the famous beast from Magma Island. There are no boats, so I decided to practice here. So do you come here often? Or what? Kinda cute. Ooh. Ooh la la. I, I have a princess to save. Okay. Um, battle axe, so I need eighteen fifty. Okay. And then a thou eighteen fifty. Wow. Oh. I need quite a bit, actually. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, it's been fun. Um, I will stream some more tomorrow. I was actually thinking about changing my schedule, maybe streaming an hour earlier, um, maybe two hours earlier. Just to see some of you guys' smiling faces. Um, we'll, we'll see, though. But anyways, it's been fun. You guys take it easy. I'll leave you guys with this awesome music.